Silet Agricultural University is situated in the northeast zone of Bangladesh Silet. The university has started its journey on 2nd November 2006. The university was started based on the then Silet Government Veterinary College, which was established in 1994. Currently, the university is offering six undergraduate degrees from six individual faculties, including its mother faculty named Faculty of Veterinary and Animal Science. The Faculty of Veterinary and Animal Science is the founding faculty of Silet Agricultural University and is the second oldest of ten similar faculties in Bangladesh. We are trying to develop our uh, research activities and we have a good number of research already. Uh, one of our professor earned best uh, research achievement uh, from University Grants Commission of Bangladesh. Uh, by this time, our graduates uh, lead veterinary entrepreneurship in Bangladesh. And we are continuously trying to improve our teaching learning process and research activities. The faculty is providing competent veterinarians who are serving for our own country as well as contributing to the modern scientific research nationally and internationally. Department of Anatomy and Histology. This department provides basic knowledge on anatomy, histology of common animal and bird species. Department of Anatomy and Histology teaches the gross anatomy, histology, and biology, comparative anatomy, surgical anatomy, cell biology, and embryology. Actually, this department give the basic foundation or knowledge about form and structures of the animals. Department of Physiology. This department provides knowledge on basic and circulatory physiology, reproductive physiology and systemic physiology as well. The main objectives of the department is to is uh, students the normal physiology of animals, normal uh, systems of animal body. Uh, if the students understand the normal physiology, they have the ability to uh, di uh, differentiate the abnormal and pathological conditions. Department of Pharmacology and Toxicology. This department provides knowledge on general pharmacology, therapeutics and toxicology. Uh, the mission of the department to offer pharmacology and toxicology education to undergraduate uh, and postgraduate students that produce knowledgeable and skilled uh, clinicians who are uh, prepared to optimize drug therapy and to pursue for their pharmacological education and research. Department of Microbiology and Immunology. This department provides knowledge on general microbiology, bacteriology, virology and immunology of animal species. We learn the students uh, the isolation, identification, cultural examination, and also uh, the diagnostic procedures uh, for those microorganisms. Our objectives of this department is the different microorganisms, those are uh, pathogenic for human uh, and animal. Department of Epidemiology and Public Health. This department provides knowledge on disease occurrence in animal and their control strategies, 
which may fall ultimate impact on human health. The objectives of this uh, department is to provide knowledge to the students about the epidemiology and, and the mm, public health matter. By following the courses in this department, students will, run, uh, which will learn how to conduct the epidemiological studies and how to combat with the uh, public health problems in Bangladesh. Department of Animal Nutrition. This department provides knowledge on fodder production, nutrition of animal and poultry species. The mission of the department is to establish and well-equipped modern animal nutrition laboratory and to set up an animal nutrition field laboratory with live animals. Department of Livestock Production and Management. This department provides knowledge on livestock production and management of different animals. This department is implementing research on livelihood improvement through promotion of dairy and milk market access to the poor farmers in how areas of Bangladesh. Department of Dairy Science. This department provides knowledge on dairy products, its production and modern dairy technology. Uh, the main objectives of establishment of the department is to produce first grade livestock graduates, scientists and researchers. The future leader in dairy sector, a well-known, significant and ever-growing component of dairy sector and food industry in Bangladesh. The mission of Dairy Science Department is to develop future leader and diffuse the science-based knowledge and solution through innovative and effective education, research and extension program in dairy sector of Bangladesh. Department of Poultry Science. This department provides knowledge on farm management of different poultry species. The main objectives to establish the department is to produce first grade livestock graduates, scientists and researchers to play key role in poultry uh, production in Bangladesh. The educational goal of the department uh, include teaching, research, training and extension. Department of Genetics and Animal Breeding. This department provides knowledge on breeding and upgradation of different animal and bird species. We are offering different courses for our faculty and other faculty. Our research activities is very strong. Now we are conducting two uh, international research programs. The Asil bird and the red jungle fowl is the uh, endangered animal in Bangladesh. But now we are trying to conserve this. Department of Parasitology. These departments provide knowledge on life cycle and significance of parasites of different animals and poultry species. This department offers courses on helminthology, malacology, entomology, and protozoology at undergraduate and postgraduate levels. The research activities are focused on biology, epidemiology and molecular characterization of the parasites and the vectors of animals and their genetic importance. Department of Pathology At this department, students learn basic pathology, systemic pathology, clinical pathology and avian pathology. We are offering a total of 14 credits on 10 different subjects related to pathology. The main aim and objectives of this department is to teach students on the pathogenesis and pathology of different diseases and uh, to aid them in disease diagnosis. Department of Medicine. This department provides knowledge on fundamental and clinical medicine, pet animal, zoo animal, farm animal and avian medicine as well. This is the core department for the degree of DVM which provides exceptional educational experiences 
delivering outstanding veterinary care and discovering innovative methods to diagnose, treat and prevent the animal diseases. Department of Surgery and Theriogenology. This department provides knowledge on techniques of surgery on different animal and bird species. Department of Surgery and Theriogenology. We have skilled veterinary doctors who are doing complicated animal surgery and handling OBG animal patients in our department. People get excellent cooperation from us for their paid and food animals. We are now planning to establish a fertility clinic and biomedical research center in our department. The faculty is providing excellent public service through a veterinary hospital named Professor Musleuddin Ahmed Choudhury Veterinary Teaching Hospital, where expert veterinarians and intern students are providing free treatments to the animals and birds. Faculty has achievements in Prime Minister gold medals. Five of the meritorious students in this faculty got Prime Minister gold medal. Department of Pathology had a great achievement in research. Professor Dr. Masudur Rahman has been awarded UGC Best Publication Award 2015. Students of this faculty including Dean Governed Association named Veterinary Students Association which plays active role in veterinary education and extracurricular activities both nationally and internationally. Honorable Vice Chancellor of Select Agricultural University, Professor Dr. Muhammad Gulam Shahi Alam, delivered speech on World Veterinary Day 2017. Uh, I'm very happy to know that the Faculty of Veterinary Animal Science of the Select Agricultural University, University is going to organize a seminar on, on the antimicrobial resistance from awareness to action. You, you know, the 60% of human pathogens are of animal origin. 75% of emerging animal diseases can be transmitted to human and 80% pathogens that could potentially be used for bioterrorism are of animal origin. Uh, and, uh, and even the one uh, emerging disease occurs every eight months. Food animal can be a source of bacteria that cause human infection. We know that the, the Campylobacter and Salmonella species are the, uh, and the resistance gene they carry are transmitted to human by a food chain or by direct exposure to the animal. Improved use of antibiotics in food animals, particularly reducing the uses of those that are critically important for human medicine is an important step toward preventing the benefits of antimicrobials for the people. Antimicrobials of value in the treatment and prevention of disease should not be used as livestock feed additives. Veterinary service can play a central role in ensuring the responsible and prudent use of antibiotics in farm animal practice. This will help to reduce the risks of developing antimicrobial resistance and unsafe level of veterinary drug residue in food of animal origin. The World Health Organization has developed and apply the criteria to rank antibiotics according to their importance in human medicine. Animal and human practitioners, regulatory bodies, policy makers and other stakeholders can use this ranking when developing risk management strategies for the use of antibacteria in food animals. The ranking allows stakeholders to focus the risk management effort on drug 
that are the most important to human medicine. I would like to extend my heartfelt gratitude and good wishes to the members of the Faculty of Veterinary Animal Sciences for their valuable effort. I wish good success of this program. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks to all.